What's going on everyone? This is your host, Overlord57, with some Gran Turismo 6. Uh, this time around we're going to be doing some public drag racing at Indianapolis Road Course. But um, again, I do ap apologize for the long delay in content to the channel. Had a lot of stuff to do lately. Been applying for jobs. Uh, I think close to a dozen of them I've applied to so far. But uh, right now, we are just going to hop in our Ford GT, which has a little ring to it, but I'll save the surprise for that here in just a minute. But, um, yeah, I just decided to get on Grand Turismo 6. haven't got on it in a while. I should say I haven't uploaded any of it in a while. It's been, I think, a little over a week now since I've uploaded anything. But, um, yeah, so I figured I would just upload... And uh, you can already tell it's a bit squirrely, so that's a little of the surprise there. Yeah, let's just go in the grass, why not? But, um, I just got done watching the uh, NASCAR race at Martinsville, and uh, as much as I hate to say it, I have to applaud Brad Keselowski. He raced uh, Denny Hamlin very clean, and I thought what he did was very professional. Gave him a little run at the end, but nothing too major, so... I applaud Brad Keselowski for that. And what a rally Jeff Gordon made at the end of the race. Alright, let's see who we can run here. We'll go ahead and, uh, ghost whatever that thing is, and a truck. So, alright, let's see who we're running here. Uh, no one yet. Alright. We'll just start all of these guys. Oh, that's a lot of people. Crap. Go. And Speed Freak didn't even move. And I don't think the Ferrari care. Well, I guess, well. Okay, maybe this time we'll go. Yeah, there he goes. And the GTR launches him and pulls him down the line. Alright, come on, I'm gonna run. Go! Ooh, Trans Am! Wow, got the great reaction time there. Rocket didn't even move. Probably because he didn't want to run the Hawaii. Well, now he wants to. What the? Deuce is. What the? I don't think he can see me. Whatever the case is. Let me just back up a little bit here. Alright. Uh, I'm not going to be your starter for too much longer. Alright, let me just get in line right here. Ooh, alright. So now you guys get to see what the surprise is if somebody ghosts us. It's quite a lengthy line of cart. Okay, well. Or you can just go. Oh, there must be somebody next to me. Alright. Here's a surprise. It's wheelie tuned! I love this 4 GT. It's the uh one of the two wheelie tuned cars I have. Here I'll show you on the way back down as well. Oop, nope, launched him first. Can't do that. Alright, let me just line it up. Go! Oh, don't go onto the drag strip. Well, there I go. Alright, straighten her back out. Straighten her back out. Alright, let's try this again. I don't care that I hit the... Well, maybe I do. Alright, let's show you my other wheelie tuned car, which is a rough BTR86. And then, once we, once I show you guys that, we'll uh, get to some legitimate drag races. There it is. A BTR86. This was actually my uh, first wheelie tuned car. Uh, I had this car for a while, so hopefully it still it might work. I'm not sure if the updates have messed with it or not, but, you know. This one actually bounces a lot more than the uh, 4 GT does. Hopefully... At least I hope it works. If it doesn't, I'll be surprised, because it should. I think it still does. Alright. Maybe. Hopefully. I don't think I have to do a wheelie with it, or a used NOS with this one, either. I might. Hang on here. Try it again. I don't want wheeling. Really. 
Come on. Off the ground. Gosh dang it. Alright, let's see if I uh, have to put a new suspension on it. I will be kind of surprised actually if I do. Cause this thing used to work. I don't know what, what it's doing wrong now. That is probably why. That needs to be backwards. That needs to be down. Don't think camber matters too much. Um, I'm gonna drop that down. I wanna throw the same suspension on this my 4GT has. Maybe that'll work. I'm not sure what my anti-roll has to be. Body? Yeah, so it still has the 200% in the back. All right, now let's try it. See if it works. It worked when I tested this at Stage Red X when I first got it. I don't see why it wouldn't work here. A 4GT does. Alright, yeah, this might be better. There we go! And it stays up. Look at that, I'm bouncing off walls and everything. Look at that. Wheelie tuned rough. That's how it's done. Oh yeah, that thing will rise. Look at that. Look at the front end. That's without NOS. That was without NOS. The only thing with this rough is it's it's, it's, uh, it's not nearly as fast as the 4GT. Alright, time to do some legitimate drag racing. And to do that, we are going to throw things back to the realm of America and hop in my most recent tune, which I might throw into this video, or I might make a separate one for it, it kind of depends, but uh, this is a Challenger SRT8. Hemi Orange, uh, 833 horse, I believe, somewhere around there. Uh, racing soft tires, custom transmission, custom suspension. Um, no aftermarket parts on it, no custom spoilers, no flat floors, things like that. But uh, I'm not sure exactly, I don't have a show car. I'm not sure how this looks like with any of that. I'm not sure it has it. But, uh, alright, yeah, let's go back to the, uh, drag strip, hopefully without wrecking, because with drag tune cars, it's so difficult to get to, uh, the actual drag strip without wrecking Exhibit A. Instant tire spin. One thing I have to compliment this Challenger on is it does have a fairly good launch. This is a nitrous tune for this Challenger too, so should uh, trap at around 166 to 167. Oh, jeez, Louise. All right, who am I running? I'm gonna run a. Um, yeah, I'll do it. Who cares? I don't know why, but you know what? I just gotta show you guys this Challenger. Well, I don't know what that was. Alright, let's go. Come on, seriously. Oh my god. I'm not backing out. I don't care. I'm not backing out. Ghost, you little person. Alright, I'll run the Trans Am. I don't care. So yeah, we trapped around 166, 167, beat that Trans Am by a couple of car lengths. Not that bad of a Trans Am. So, now we will get in, I oh, jeez. 
that's a top speed car, that's a top speed car, that's too old. Well, it's it's a good car, but not when you have GTRs and Lancers and Ferraris on the track. So I think we just might have to get in a MP4. Love MP4s. Mine is uh, pretty good. Shout out to uh, BK Stevens, who's the host of the lobby for tuning it. Uh, he gave me a uh, transmission suspension, so got to thank him for that. Quick shout out there. I will show you what my MP4 does, and then we will end the video because, as I see it now, we're up close to 11 minutes. So. Oh, I forgot. I run comfort hards in the front. This thing is really difficult to turn. Oh my gosh. The only reason I run in like 6th and 7th gear is so I don't spin the tires. I do believe this is a quick shift at around 8,000 RPM. Alright, let's check it out. Alright, you don't want to run the GTR, I know that. Not running you, you stupid Evo. Don't even think about it. No. Oh. oh, come on, Viper. Get up here. Go. Go. Viper, go. Alright, that works too. Come on in. Alright, let's see what this thing does against a GTR, which will most likely get a launch. No, I handily launch it. Wow! could barely see his name, trapped at about 184. So this MP4 is pretty quick. Like I said, you shift at 8,000 RPM, gets you down the track fast. Alright, let's keep it straight, keep it straight, keep it straight. And we're going to run a, looks like a, a Spirit now. Oh, hey, look, it's BK. If I'm not wrong, that uh, Spirit is Wheelie Tune. So, let's see what it can do. Yeah, he's doing a wheelie. But, still nothing for this MP4. Trapped around, well, hi there. Trapped around 185 that time. I like my MP4. This is kind of my uh, go-to supercar when it comes to dragging. I really, really like this. Evos do not belong against an MP4. I actually have a, uh, my Challenger, like I said, can handily beat most, uh, Evos, and I'm almost positive my Camaro can as well. Camaro SS 2010. Alright, I don't know what that is, but we're gonna run it. No NOS this time. So no NOS trap around 170. Doink. Like I said, I still haven't changed the trans... I still don't have a NOS transmission for this. This is just... This tune is a uh, no-NOS tune, but since you short shift, it kind of works for both, I guess. And we slide for a really long time. And to rub it in the for face of the four-wheel drives, let's run this GTR one last time, and then we're going to go ahead and end this video. Yeah, no, I'll no-NOS you. Let's go. There he goes. Man, that was a straight run, too. Alright, uh, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, I might throw up some drag tunes in the future for some of the cars you've seen. Um, the 4GT, which is really tuned, as you saw earlier, will be one of those. So if you want to see that, be sure to subscribe. 
We are up to uh, 16 subscribers on the channel, so I have to thank you guys for that. Um, most of these cars you see here are drag tuned. That one is... That one's top speed, top speed, drag, drag, drag. Just have it. Just have it. Tuned. Uh, drag tune, drag tune, drag, drag. Have it, have it. Top speed. So, most of the cars you see here are drag tuned. Um, if you guys want to see some more Gran Turismo 6 up on the channel, be sure to drop this video a like. This is your host, Overlord57, signing out.